Hello everyone. So I want to practice my art skills and I want to challenge myself and draw highly challenging parts of the body, like hands, because hands are definitely, most of the time, not a fun time. And I'm practicing hands today, because that's what I do. I see people posting their workout videos everywhere on social media and since going to the gym is not really my cup of tea. Um, this is as close as I can get to a workout, so I'm using a website called Sketch Daily. I'll put a link so you can check it out in case you want to draw. And it is a great tool for practicing drawing from references and you can choose from specific body parts to full nudes to costumes, you name it. I chose specifically hands since usually they're not a fun time and I'm here to face my demons. I don't know what it is, maybe it's the phalanges, the, you know, too many joints in too little space, right? I don't know. Anyway, and that's why drawing a character with the hands behind the back is always a good option. This website randomizes a picture every five minutes. You can set the time to whichever is best for you. And the goal isn't to have pretty hand drawings by the end of this, but to get the anatomy right, or at least as nearly right as possible, and to do it as easily and as effortless as we move along from one exercise to the other as the rust starts to dissipate from your fingers and giving space to all the fuzzy warm feelings of art pleasure. The most important thing is to make progress on your insecurities. I realized that using the grey as part of the sketching process helps defining the light and shadow rather than just using lines and both methods kind of work together as you can clean up the drawing as you go and just as if you are sculpting or carving something, not that I know how to carve at all, but you get what I mean, right? No. As you can see, some of these positions are very nice. So you have the guy giving us a middle finger, which is a must, and the forever alone pose, which is a guy holding hands with himself. That's pretty sad, but that's also a great practice. So have that in mind when drawing this. Let me know if you're practicing as well. I hope you do and I will talk to you soon. Bye!